We've all had that feeling. You know, the one where you've just sent an important email message, and a few moments later you go back to review it? <laughs> that was a great email I just sent. I'm going to go back and read it one more time. Whoops. Oh, no. Look at that typo. You notice a nasty mistake. Maybe it's a misspelled word, or maybe it's a sentence you modified which no longer makes sense in the context you sent. Or perhaps you pasted a form reply, but accidentally called a customer by another customer's name. You wish you could pull that message back, but it's already been read. We all occasionally make mistakes, right? Maybe you work in a noisy area or are subject to numerous interruptions and distractions. Or perhaps you always seem to be up against time constraints. Consider the unintended consequence of sending a business email that contains a mistake. Yeah, I really like this company, but the person that I'm dealing with seems to be illiterate. A client could quickly lose confidence in you or your organization if a common word is misspelled or misused or if a sentence doesn't make sense. Whether we like it or not, customers, co-workers, or supervisors could judge you or may draw conclusions about your intelligence if they receive written communication that are below the standards they expect. The answer to this challenge is to get in the habit of proofreading every single message before it's sent. So when you're ready to click send, invest a few moments to check for misspelled words and to read your entire message for proper content. Obviously, use your spell checker and if available, a grammar checker to identify trouble spots. Are there any typos or misspelled words? What about words spelled correctly but where you accidentally use the wrong version? And don't forget about punctuation that needs correcting. At the same time you're doing your proofreading review, also take a moment to inspect the addresses in your two.